In this video, we're on the pull. Hi guys, this is Rack and Load, and this is the Lyman Trigger Pull Gauge. Now, you will have seen me use this in a number of videos when reviewing guns just to test the triggers to see what sort of poundage they're pulling at. Uh, and I thought I'd just throw out a little review of this uh, handy bit of kit. Uh, it really is a handy bit of kit, especially if you're into your reviewing or just into your gunsmithing. Now, let me just show you the packaging that it comes in first before we sort of talk about the actual thing. Well, I've got rid of half the packaging, but this is the important bit. This is like the cardboard thing that's on the back of it. I've got rid of that horrible plastic stuff that you have to gouge scissors and knives into just to get the blooming thing out. Um, but yeah. Lyman Electronic Digital Trigger Pull Gauge, the world's most accurate, when I can say it, trigger gauge. Now, it really is a good bit of kit. Works with virtually any firearm. Obviously, make sure your gun's unloaded before you do it, and all that safety stuff. This is it. It's fully adjustable. It'll pull any sort of trigger on any firearm. Accurate up to one-tenth of an ounce, or two grams, ergonomically designed. Uh, easy to read LCD display, reads in, reads in pounds and ounces or metric, kilograms and grams. Uh, it's got a memory as well. Uh, I don't really use that. I tend to just give it a gun that I'm testing. I'll just give sort of two or three pulls. Um, and it's got like the roller thing as well that sort of self centers onto the trigger. Um, that's all your sort of measuring sort of specifications that I've kind of just read out. Um, it really is a good bit of kit. I mean, there's a picture there using it on a pistol and then like on, on a rifle there. Oh, a left handed rifle as well. Um, but I'll demo it here on uh, these two guns that I've got in front of me Benelli Supernova and a Gamo Coyote PCP. Uh, I'll just put this thing together. Well, before I put it together, I'll show you the bag that you get with it. Now, you can get these for, I think they're about £70 here in the UK. Um, I got this from my local gun shop. Um, just something I needed to do sort of proper, half-decent reviews anyway. But it comes in a nice pouch, nice sort of protective pouch. Your instructions... I'll show you the instructions while I've got them out. Quite in depth um, instructions as well. I'm not going to read it all out, but um, but that's pretty much your instructions, just a sheet. But it tells you everything you need to kind of know. Um, and the rest really is self explanatory, you're just pulling the trigger, really. But that that's the, the case it comes in anyway. It's, uh, it is um, a nice durable case. You've got a spare compartment there for um, bits and pieces and everything sort of just strapped in. So that's the case I'm waffling on there. And this is the actual good bit. <laughs> so yeah, just this trigger bar just screws in like so. And then you can adjust it to however you want it, what sort of angle, which way you're going to be pulling it. Um, and just just do that one up there get that nice and tight and that's like the actual bit that self centers and rolls on the trigger sort of free rolling so I'll show you how this thing works so let's cock this coyote now it is in a safe direction and there's no magazine in it we'll give this thing a trigger pull so, press that. Now this thing is quite sensitive, well it's very sensitive, it's even registering me just moving it around. So let's uh, give this thing a pull. Two pounds, 6.4 ounces. So let's give it another one. I'll have to cock it again, I'm gonna say. So press it again, press it reset, and there's the display for pull it again. Look, got your pounds, 
and your outs is there. So it is mega accurate really for what you want. So we'll try it on this shotgun. Just make sure it's clear. Now to be honest, I wouldn't really be mega fussed on the trigger on a shotgun, especially a hunting shotgun like this. See, that's quite a lot heavier. Eight pounds, three ounces. Quite a lot heavier on the shotgun. But to be honest, it's a hunting shotgun. I'd want it he heavy anyway. It's not like it's a target gun. Although I do use it mainly for target but um, yeah it's a great little bit of kit anyway this Lyman trigger pull is um, gives you your averages I mean I've done uh, several pulls there I've done a few off camera as well um, it gives you the average so you could if you're really sort of a perfectionist you could give your gun 10 pulls and then just press the average and you know what it's doing you can adjust it to Kilos, like I said, that's giving the average in kilos and grams. That's your reset button. But a very useful bit of kit, guys. Takes your smoke alarm battery or your 9 volt square battery. Obviously don't take them out of your smoke alarm when you get one of these. It does come with a battery, by the way, it is supplied with a battery. But, good little bit of kit for the reviewer, the gunsmith, or just the tinkerer. Very good bit of kit to have. And it all disassembles just by unscrewing that. And it will switch off by itself as well. And just goes neatly back in its storage case. It's got like Velcro bits there to stow it all. Cool bit of kit. Well, that's it, guys. That's the Lyman trigger pull gauge. That's your rack and low review. Thanks for watching. See ya.